So you probably haven't heard about this in the news, but a few days ago, the president of Chad, Idris Debi Itnu, was killed while on the front lines fighting the FACT rebel group, which has been trying to topple his regime for a while. Debi first took control of the country in 1990, ruling non-stop for more than 30 years until being killed on Tuesday. His son, Mahamat Debi Itnu, took control of the country immediately after his death. He instituted a transitional military council, which, according to the council, will allow for democratic elections to be held after 18 months, following foreign leaders encouraging the council to end soon. This move has prompted the FACT rebels to approach the capital, N'Djamena, in retaliation to the government, who they view as acting unconstitutional by instating a monarchy. Despite the threats from rebels, several world leaders, including French President Emmanuel Macron, paid respects to Debi on Friday in N'Djamena. The FACT rebels are currently based out of Libya and allegedly being trained by Russian mercenaries. The Chadian military government of Mahamat Debi is supported by France and the United States, who have helped Chad fight terrorist movements across the Sahel. I hope you guys like this sort of thing in the future because I'm going to be making these short current event reports sporadically from now on. Subscribe to Mad Mac to see more of this in the future.